guys, welcome to the Lion's Den. I'm your host, Joey Zadmer. So let me give you a tour of the place. Come on in. Glad you brought your crew. Before we get to the gym, I uh, just want to show you what I have stocked in my fridge here. Yo, uh, uh, Joe, so, Joe, yeah. we're, we're not doing Crips today. This is Crips? It's actually 20, 21, not uh, 2000 and one. You're kidding me. Uh, well, in, the, in that case, um, I think we're going to do the, uh, the Nick Bear chest workout. So let's get to it. Very high volume, very high intensity, very slick. Hello guys, Coach Joe here at the Lion's Den, and like Matt said, this is not cribs. All right, we're doing the Nick Bear chest workout. So uh, I'm actually getting into endurance training on top of strength training, uh, kind of just like Coach Matt has done, who's behind the camera. Uh, but my goal is to do an Ironman next fall. Okay, so November we're looking either uh, to do Maryland or Tennessee uh, for our Ironman. And someone who's big in the endurance world on YouTube, especially, is Nick Bear. So been kind of looking through some of his videos and figured before we get into some more endurance stuff, I want to try one of his more bro or bodybuilding workouts. So we got the Nick Bear chest workout. What exactly is it? It's basically two giant sets, okay? So the first one is going to be a dumbbell chest press, then we have a cable fly, and then an incline hex press. We're substituting that because there is a machine that I don't have in this gym, but basically we're going to mimic the movement pattern by doing an incline hex press. Uh, then we move on to giant set number two, which is going to be an incline uh, barbell press. We have push-ups and dips. Now the way it's going to work is both giant sets are going to be for four sets. The first one, everything is going to be 10 to 15 reps. And then the bottom one, the incline barbell press, we have 10 to 15 reps. And then the push-ups and the dips are going to be for an AM rep. So kind of my thought process going into this, guys, is we're just going to get a sick pump. Uh, that's kind of the premise, I think, of this video. Is It is like a bro-style workout, hit it hard get a ton of blood to the muscle, um, and uh, we'll dive right into it. So I'm gonna start warming up, and let's just get right to it. Ah, so, uh, disclaimer, I did chest two days ago, so I'm still getting some residual soreness. We're gonna push through it. I think he was using like 115s, the highest I have here is 100, so my goal is just to use the 100s for my sets. Uh, you know, I may probably be still within that 15 rep range, like a little bit more, whatever. Uh, but Coach Matt and I were just talking speed of endurance stuff. I'll be in Virginia Beach uh, next week. My buddy's a SEAL, and he was a swim coach for a long time. He's done a lot of endurance races, and obviously if you're a SEAL, you gotta be pretty good swimming. So he's gonna give me some swim lessons. I don't know if we can video any of it, uh, just to keep his you know, name and face anonymous, uh, but I will definitely talk about it when I return. Oh no. Oh no. <laughs> I think I think I overestimated myself by uh, the the last of those hex presses. You're your shot. You're shot. Those 55s, I might do like 75s, 80s, but I'm resting, so it's that it's that high volume, no rest. I think bears used to that endurance crap. I'm not. Ugh. Oh, check this out. I actually flexed my bicep now. After I had the surgery, I couldn't really flex it. Now I actually can have a my muscle connection. It's fantabulous. That's a new word for us, fantabulous. It's fantastic and fabulous. All right. Are you ready, kids? This is the hardest one right here. This sucks. This sucks. I mean, talking about it, ain't gonna get it done. Right there. Oh, 
Holy crap. Dude, I ain't gonna be able to feel my boobies. People be trying to shoot me with bullets. It goes ding, ding, just like that. This workout is straight up like pump uh, destruction is what he's trying to do here. Um, so yeah, you're getting it done in a quick amount of time. Uh, there's two giant sets. So if you're someone who's tight on time, uh, or maybe you have to go to a party and you wanna make your chest look like the size of planet Earth, you should hit this right before you go to your party and give yourself about 30 to 35 minutes and you're gonna look like a freak. All right, we got uh, 135 on the bar. Matt, how much did he do in the video? Yeah, he did yeah, two plates though. He did 225? He did 225. You're, you're joking. You're not kidding? 225, yeah. <laughs> and he got 15? I, I put 10 to 15 down for you, so you had something to shoot for. I think he just am wrapped it. Well, uh, listen, I want to show him up in his own video, you know what I'm saying? So I'm just playing a little bit conservative. 135. Listen, the real question is, did he just come back from a bicep tear? No, he did not come back from a bicep tear. So let's go. All right, I underestimated myself. I think we can go up just a smidge. Maybe 185. 110. 111. 112. Dude. Uh. Mm. Mm. All right. All right. We gotta go to dips. We gotta go to dips now. This man is sick. This man is so sick. God. I was doing the weird, the weird thing with your legs, where you're like, <laughs> please subscribe to my Patreon, please, please do it. I think I like two more. Just got done with you. I like thought I could go up, and then I did the push-ups, and then I did the dips. And 135 is feeling real nice right about now. <laughs> Dang. Man, I was just saying, like, this takes you back to the old days, the old times. Like a year ago, no, I'm kidding. Uh, like 10, 10 plus years ago for me of hitting like bro workouts with your boys, just throwing weight on the bar, making plate jumps that you probably failed. And uh, <laughs> so it's fun, it's fun, but. Yeah, I probably wouldn't do this all the time. Definitely not, definitely not. Like I said, before a party, trying to get swole, hit this up, time crunch, hit this up. You think I'm not resting long enough? I think that was the point. Not to rest, right? I'm just trying to figure out like, why I suck so bad at this. I'm trying to just give myself some excuses. Jumps up! I got like three more. I got I got three more. Super da. Come on. Oh, you see that, dude? Oh my god. This is the, the stupid. Woo! Guys, that was pretty ridiculous. I'm pretty out of breath and I'm pretty pumped. I think on the scale of Nick Bear, I ranked uh, an F. <laughs> but it's better than a Z. That's how I look at it. Man, that guy's a freak. He was cranking out 225 on there. He's doing 115 dumbbells. Animal, complete savage. Really respect the guy. You know, like I said, I'm coming back from a bicep tear. So I'm just happy to be training. 
Uh, you know, happy to do what I can do. But boy, oh boy, was that legit. So if you guys are trying to pack in a sick workout, gnarly pump, tons of volume, uh, do this, give it a shot. We explained the workout at the beginning of the video. Go and check out all of his stuff. He's an endurance animal. I think mostly endurance right now, not so much training anymore, but either way, freak nonetheless. Uh, but yeah, so as always guys, we really appreciate your support. Make sure you like the video, subscribe to the channel, check out our uh, Facebook group, The Iron Lions. Type it in the Facebook search bar. Great community of people, totally free. We do articles, form checks, all sorts of goodies. Check out the website, zastrength.net, where we have programs, more articles, fantastic content written by Matt behind the camera. Check out his channel. And then lastly, we got the Patreon. So Patreon slash Zastrength all exclusive content. Your donations help build this channel uh, and help just create high quality content. So thank you so much, guys. I am going to uh, go get a chest massage to eradicate some of this blood in here because it's pretty bad. And I'll see you guys next time. Stay lean, me track machine. Peace.